Now, let us discuss about the question number 11 from exercise 15.3, chapter 15. If P is any point in the interior of parallelogram ABCD, then prove that area of triangle APB is less than half the area of parallelogram. Now, moving on to the solution. Here it is given that ABCD is a parallelogram. and P is some point in the interior of the parallelogram and here if we join AP and PB a triangle is formed he asked us to prove that area of the triangle formed is less than the half times area of the whole parallelogram so in order to prove that let us draw DN perpendicular to AB and PD perpendicular to AB now we know the formula for area of parallelogram ABCD that is equal to base into corresponding height here let us consider the base as AB into the corresponding height here is DN as it is perpendicular to AB therefore we got the area of parallelogram ABCD as product of AB into DN. Now, let us take area of triangle ADB, APB that is equal to half times base that is AB into height here is PD since it is perpendicular to AB. Now, we know that PD is less than dn let us multiply on both sides by ab then we get ab into pd will be less than ab into dn let us multiply again both sides by half then we get half ab into pd is less than half times ab into dn which implies we have that half times ab times pd is area of triangle apb therefore let us replace that area of triangle apb is less than half times in the bracket we have here the product of ab and dn but we know that the product of ab and dn is area of parallelogram ABCD therefore let us substitute this then we get area of parallelogram ABCD here finally we can say that the area of triangle APB is less than the half times area of so finally we can say that area of triangle APB is less than half times area of whole parallelogram ABCD this is what the required proof for us